The best part of waking up is Fajr in your prayers. Oh, you know what's cool about these uh, Islamic dresses is that they like double as PJs. Let me tell you something, brother. Let me give you the key to success. If you want to live forever, if you want Jannah so you never die, but inherit all those beautiful big-breasted huris who make my chest look like it's a small, tiny thing in comparison, then here's what you got to do. You got to perform the six pillars of Islam, brother, starting with the first, Shahada. If you say, La ilaha illallah, and Muhammad Rasulullah, then that's the first pillar, and you enter into the fold of Islam, and you become a Sharia maniac. But there's more to it, brother, because Allah and his messenger expect a lot more if you want to get your hurries, <laughs> who make my pythons look like they're little garden snakes, brother. Don't move. Ow! Ow! What'd you do that for? You're welcome. Ah! There's a fly in my food! You Fred Durst look-alike. Oh, throw it away and get another bowl, dude. Actually... Backpack. What do I do if a fly lands in my food? Looks like we've got some guidance from the Prophet himself. Sahih Bukhari 3320. Narrated Abu Huraira, the Prophet said, if a house fly falls into the drink of any one of you, he should dip it in the drink, for one of its wings has a disease, and the other has the cure for the disease. Whew! No, thank you. Uh-uh. I ain't doing that. Say what? Uh, Maybe you need a second opinion. Sunan Abu Dawood 3844. It was narrated that Abu Huraira said, the Messenger of Allah said, if a fly falls into the vessel of one of you, then immerse it, for on one of its wings is a disease and on the other is a cure. When it falls, it falls onto the wing on which is a disease, so immerse it fully. Is that what it really says? That's what it really says, so if you want the cure for the disease that that fly is carrying, you gotta dunk that fly, man. Dunk the fly, man. Dunk it. Dunk it. Dunk it. Dunk it. Get all the cure. You want all the cure. You want all that fly's cure. You want all the cure. Now eat it. Dunk it. Eat it. Get it all. Get all the cure. Get all the cure. Woo! I think there's a bug going around. Kind of bug or something, so it's trying to be safe. He had he had a, a bowl of cereal. Yeah, yeah. I Look. smacked the fly and it landed in the cereal. Yeah, it wasn't like pork cereal or anything, was it? No, no okay. pork in it. Okay. And then he dunked the fly because Muhammad said to dunk the flies. There's a disease on one wing, but then there's the cure for it. Yeah, yeah. So if if it just landed in there and you got you got the the bad side, then you would just get the disease. That's why you dunk it all the way. And you get the cure as well. He ate the fly. The Jews could have poisoned the fly? There should still be the... Oh, whoa. What if they tore off the wing that has the cure? The Jews know stuff like that. They could have tore off the wing that had the cure in it. And left whoa, 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 the whoa, disease whoa. wing for our friend. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Hang on, hang on. We're, now we're going that. into conspiracy theories. There may actually be a much simpler explanation here. What? Maybe Jamal caught lactose intolerance. That's why he got sick. Yeah, that disease is communicable ability. I've heard and, about and that. You, there is no cure for that. Yeah, once you have it. Oh, dude. That means he, he can't. He can't have milk anymore. Just keep him away from milk. His body should be All good. All right, well, as long as we keep him away from milk, 
he'll be good.